Baruch Dayan Hamet, we praise the judge of truth. Death has taken our beloved Shirley Paula Sofer. Friends grieve in their darkened world. In their silence, there's lamentation, in their tears, there's loneliness. Lost in their sorrow, may they find the presence of loving friends. Hear them, O God, and be with them. For Shirley's love that united us in life and which death cannot sever. For her companionship that was shared along life's path and which continues through the tenderness of memory, for the gifts of her heart and mind that brought joy and happiness and is now a precious remembrance. For all of these and more, we give our thanks to God. In this time of grief, we listen to the voice of our sacred scriptures from Sefer Tehillim from the Book of Psalms. It tells us of our kinship with the Creator. In light as in darkness, in joy as in sorrow, in life as in death. Together let us recite the 23rd Psalm. The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. He maketh me to lie down in green pastures. He leadeth me beside the still waters. He restoreth my soul. He guideth me in straight paths for his name's sake. Yea, though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil, for thou art with me. Thy rod and thy staff, they comfort me. Thou preparest a table before me in the presence of mine enemies. Thou hast anointed my head with oil, my cup runneth over. Surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life, and I shall dwell in the house of the Lord forever. Forever. On the one hand, you want to face your dearly departed. On the other hand, when everybody is over here, you want to face over here too. So we're going to go back and forth just a little bit. We gather this morning to pay our respects and a deserved tribute to your dear Shirley Sofer, Shando, but they the lake. Shano comes from the Yiddish Shano, which is, you know, pretty beautiful. <laughs> Shirley was everybody's friend. Yeah. She was a real yeah. character. Yeah. yeah. She was a great bowler. She had 180 average. Yeah. Anybody who's bowled, that's an average. Yeah. 180 average. She could type more than 100 words a minute. She could keep track of it. She could look at you. She could hold a conversation and not make typing mistakes. She had great hand-eye coordination. She loved casinos and gambling. She was all about Vegas. As the kids remembered Shirley 
and her sense of humor, her Mishigas, which is Yiddish for craziness, yeah. her zest for life, yeah. Mishigas, Mishigas, yeah. new word for you, <laughs> craziness, um, and her zest for life. It's a reminder of a favorite Talmudic teaching. There's a, a great story in the Talmud, in Ta'anit, <clears throat> is the tractate, page 22a. 22a, check this out. It's a Talmudic story about Rabbi Yochanan ben Baroka. Rabbi Yochanan ben Baroka lived in the second century, and he was a saintly rabbi, and he spent, he constantly was pondering life beyond the grave. And the secret of life and death. And one day, Rabbi Yochanan was walking through a town square, and he came into direct spiritual communication with Elijah the prophet, Eliyahu Hanavi, whom we invite to the Passover Seder every year. Elijah the prophet, who's supposed to be the forerunner of the messianic time of universal brotherhood, sisterhood, and peace. And so Rabbi Yochanan ben Baroka asked Elijah, Will any of these people in the marketplace here share the bliss of the world to come after they have died and I have died? And Elijah points to two people on the far end of the market square, and the Talmud says they are entertaining people with their playfulness, which could be, it could be a card trick, it could be any sort of a thing. And Rabbi Yochanan ben Baroka asked, what? I mean, these simple performers are going to be my companions in the world to come? What merits do they possess? And Elijah answered, they have joyful, fun-loving spirits that brighten up the hearts of others. And in so many ways, that was Shirley. Yeah. Was she religious in a sense of being religious? Religious? No. But was she religious in terms of being fun and joyful and mishugana and crazy? And actually helping to take care of people too. Yeah, she was very religious when it came to that. She was the elder of two children born to Louis and Lillian Tolan, both of blessed memory. Shirley was born in Mount Sinai Hospital of blessed memory. Mount Sinai Hospital, December 27th, 1934. Her younger brother, Paul, although he goes by Butch, Butch survives her in California. Anytime that we mention Butch from now on, it's going to be Butch, not Paul. They told me his name is Paul, but Thank you, it never goes by Paul. Nope. There's a nephew, Chris. Is Chris here? Hi, Chris. And Anna. Thank you for representing your, your father. So, two children, Shirley and Butch. She has an ex-husband of blessed memory, Stephen Sulfur, and she has three children and four grandchildren, Eric, Diane, Joe, Margaret, Scott, his girlfriend Sue, John, wife Caitlin, Mary, James, and his girlfriend Cass, and Lindsay. So this is a family. There's no shortage of characters in this family. <laughs> Which life can be very, very difficult. It's actually good to have characters in your family. She wanted to be a court reporter at one time, and then she got married and she didn't go into it. Somebody's heckling the funeral? Unbelievable. <laughs> Shirley would be heckling right back. Oh, yeah. yeah. She'd give her the right shit back. Oh, yeah. She has good friend Bobby DeSantic, DeSatnik and Marsha Nasso? Naso. Naso. Who say so? Naso. Where, is that you? Marsha. You guys were going to go, you're going to buy an RV and travel around the country. It's not too late. <laughs> Just get a driver. <laughs> Just get a driver to take you. Ah, oh, you were great friends. Yeah. All right, she went to John Adams High School in East Cleveland. Um, she loved to play poker on the smartphone. 
at the hospital, they were always amazed at how quickly she could play, you know, poker on the phone. Can't at, even at her age. And I'm not saying that. I'm saying that to a bunch of people that are like her age, right? She was incredible. <laughs> she loved to watch football. She loved all sorts of sports. She loved smoke white fish from Davis mm. Bakery. Mm. This woman was filled with a lot of love. Uh, she worked a couple of days a week for Scott. I don't know if she loved that. She loved it. She loved it. Okay. It good retirement for her. Well, she went out to California for a family wedding recently, and uh, they were all together. And sadly, she took ill. And when a loved one takes ill, it's uh, it, it puts everything into a different perspective. Thank God you were able to be out there for that wedding together. Because you never know. You never know. Uh, last three or four years, she'd go out to California to winter with Butch, and they had a good time. But by the time that trip ended, Butch was ready for her to leave. <laughs> <laughs> or so the kids said. Um, she was... Uh, she was a woman who spoke her mind and uh, she was a woman who was um, how would you say this um, she was not delicate in her discussions she was not delicate in her conduct uh, at the bowling alley or if she had a disagreement with somebody um, however people like this are a blessing too when she had her knee surgery, she was at the, I, I went to the house and she's on the couch, her legs are up. It was like it never happened. She couldn't get up to, to move, but her, her, her conversation was the same kind of salty kind of a conversation. And I'm, I'm her rabbi and she's, she's talking to me like this too, yeah. <laughs> which I appreciated. Last Friday night, she breathed her last and now she's at peace and she, she passed as the Sabbath is coming in, which is mm. a pretty religious thing to do. You're right. Just as Shabbat is a time of rest and wholeness and peace, so for our dear Shirley, it's a time of rest and peace. Our Jewish tradition, oh, this hat. This was her gambling hat, this hat. She oh, wore yeah. this whenever she would go to Vegas. Oh, my any casino, it didn't have to be Any Vegas. casino? Any oh, casino, yeah. it didn't matter. Even a poker Do you game. still have the, even a poker, do you still it's have the her. hat? It's, it's with her. her. It's the hat is with her? Oh, yeah. Yes. yeah. Well, you can't get it back now. Nope. <laughs> oh, my goodness. <laughs> oh, my goodness. It is a great picture. It is a great picture. It is. Our, our Jewish tradition believes that her soul returns to God to be with the souls of her dear parents, and relatives and friends and ancestors of our people. We learn this in Ecclesiastes chapter 12, verse 7. The dust returns to the earth as it was. The spirit returns to God who gave it. One day all of us will join our dear ones in Olam Haba in the world to come. The world to come is not a place. This is a place. The world to come is an eternal time. It is a, it's a time when your souls will be together. God will take care of the souls of our loved ones. It's a spiritual existence. The family is sending along some old prayer books in the casket. It's a mitzvah to escort the body of our loved one to its final resting place and also holy books of our tradition to pro provide respectful burial. Your memories are filled to overflowing. And after we finish with the burial, you're invited to go to the Winking Lizard in, it's Mayfield in Mayfield Heights. Heights. It's at the, East it's, a, behind it's East in Eastgate. Eastgate, behind Eastgate, near the movie theater there. Where your memories, which are filled to overflowing, will be able to, to, to overflow and bring forth thought, songs and memories about your dear Shirley. Yeah. We give thanks to God for the, the gift of this long life. 89 years plus it's a good long time. We would have hoped for more, and we would have hoped for more in health. As each of us knows who has experience with this, and that's most of us. 
when you're not going to be in good health and it's a long, 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 long drawn out thing, you, you would prefer your loved one to go sooner than later, even as sad as it is, because now she's at mm -hmm. peace. And so we say with tears in our eyes, words from the first chapter of the book of Job. Adonai Natan, Adonai Lakach, Yihisheim Adonai Muvarach. The Lord hath given, the Lord hath taken away. Blessed be the name of the Lord. And let us say, Amen. Amen. Ose Shalom Bim Romav, Uya Ase Shalom Aleinu, Ve Arko Yisrael. The Imru, Imru, Amen. Yahse Shalom, Yahse Shalom, Shalom Aleinu, the Alko Yisrael. Yahse Shalom, Yahse Shalom, Shalom Aleinu. Be Israel. May God who causes peace to reign in the high heavens cause peace to reign down upon us, upon all Israel, and upon the soul of our dearly departed. Surely, so far, and let us say Amen. Amen. Those who can, please let us rise for El Malay Rachamim. If you cannot, that's okay. Into your care, O oh God, we entrust the spirit of our dear Shirley Sulfur. Shando Bat Leb Veleka. God, you keep faith with your children in death as in life. Sustain us that we may meet with serenity the mysteries that lie ahead, knowing that when we walk through the valley of the shadow of death, you, O oh God, are with us, a loving friend in whom we put our trust. You are the light of our life, our hope in eternity. El male rachamim, shochein bamromim, hametzem rocha nechona, tachat kanfe hashchina, im kedoshim utorim, Kizohara kia maziri et nishmat shendo bade veleka shalachal olama baal harachamim yaskireha besete kenafav le olamim vayitzro betzro hachayim. Et nishmata Adonai hunachalata Vitanu akwe shalom al meshkava Vinoma Amen Compassionate God Eternal Spirit of the Universe, grant perfect rest in your sheltering presence to our dear Shirley Sofer. She has entered eternity. O God of mercy, let her find <coughs> refuge in the shadow of your wings, and let her soul be bound up in the bond of everlasting life. God is her inheritance. May she rest in peace, and let us say, Amen. 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 And let us sanctify God's name in her loving memory as we recite the Kaddish Prayer. Yit Gadal Vyit Kadash Shme Rabah Baarma Divrah Hirute Vyam Lik Mahute Bhai Khon Vyome Khon Vhai de Khol Bait Yisrael Bagala Vizman Kari Vimru Amen Yahesh Me Rabam Varak Lamala Mer Maya Yit Barak Vish Tabak Vit Paar Vit Roman Vit Nase Vita Tarvi Talevi Talash made Kudisha Berichu. The Alam in Kobir Hatam Shirata, Tushpe Hatam and Nakamata, Dami Ram Baama Vimru Amen. Yehe Shlama Raba Minch Maya, Vechaim Alev Al Kor Israel Vimru Amen. 
Ose shalom bim ramav, huya se shalom, aleinu v'al kol Yisrael, v'imru, amen. May God grant peace to those who mourn and comfort to all who are bereaved, and let us say, Amen. 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 So it's customary for us to put earth upon the casket. Uh, there are also some playing cards, apparently, that you're going to toss in. <laughs> and so uh, the family can come over and begin to place earth and cards in the casket, uh, on top of the casket. Lech Hishilach Adonai, go your way, for the Lord has called you. Lech Adonai Yeimach, go your way, and may the Lord be with you. Vahalach Lefanecha Tzikecha, Kivod Adonai Yasfecha. May your righteousness go before you, and may the glory of God receive you. Joe and Scott, you can head over so you can toss the shovel some earth onto the casket. You can go first, but just don't take too much of it. And then others can come and engage in this mitzvah also. Lech Yishulacha Adonai. Go your way, for the Lord has called you. Lech Adonai Yeimach. Go your way, and may the Lord be with you. May your righteousness go before you, and may the glory of the Lord receive you. Would everyone who is here not wearing the mourner's ribbon, Please repeat these words after me, speaking them to the mourners. May God console you with all who mourn in Zion and Jerusalem. Hamakom yinachem etchem betoch sha'avet etzion v'yerushalayim. Now let each person go forth in peace to life. Live your life in a way that will make Shirley's memory, a blessing, and honor her. We'll recite Kaddish for her tonight at services, and we will recite Kaddish for the next four weeks. Whether any family members are able to attend or not, we'll say Kaddish for her, beginning tonight. And this concludes our service here, and people may toss in earth. And may her memory be for a blessing. There you go.
trading cards. That's what you bought. There you go.